that's mine. Hey, what's mine? I'm a star. I'm a star. Cause I slay. I slay. I slay. I slay. I slay. Hi everyone. Um, basically, first what we're gonna do is use this um, razor to just clean up the outside of our brow. I prefer to do this because it makes it easier to shape out your brow when you are applying the product, and it just looks cleaner when you apply the concealer. Now we're going to use the airspun setting powder to basically take out any excess oil that we may have on our skin. I personally have very oily skin so this just helps the product to stick throughout the day. And after we are done we're just going to just sweep away the excess setting powder and then after that we will take a spoolie and just run it through our brows to take out the remainder of the powder that may be in it. We're going to be using the e.l.f. Lock On Brow Cream in Medium Brow to fill in our brows. If you are a first timer, I would suggest you use a pencil to give you more control because this product is very slippery because it is a cream. Now we're just gonna just follow the shape of our brow and just fill it in. I personally like that bold look so I will outdraw my brows. Now we're just going to use the spoolie to just run through the brow to make sure the product spreads and also don't forget to fade the front of your brows out unless you do like the boxy brow look. I personally don't like that look. You can leave your brow like this if you are just wearing your brow by itself. Now we're going to be using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Fawn to just clean out in the outside of our brows. You don't have to use this shade. I personally use this shade because I am going to be doing a full face after this and after I put all my, my products on, this don't look as harsh. So if you are just going for an everyday look, I would suggest you use a shade or two lighter than your skin tone instead so it would would not come out as harsh now this is a very very tricky part so I would suggest you just take your time just go very slowly if you have to Now right here I'm using my finger to blend out the concealer mainly because your fingers you are able to control it more while as using the brush it's more easier for you to mess up with the brush so your fingers is much more easier. And right here I know a lot of people say don't do this because it does give you that really highlighted look when you finish doing your um, foundation and everything but I when I do this it actually just works for me and I actually like the highlighted look but this part is optional you could just use your foundation for this part and then again use your fingers to blend out the top And it's okay if you do mess up in, in this part, just use your um, pomade to just fill in the spots that you did mess up. <laughs> you guys, this is a very big difference. Right here, I'm basically just repeating the steps that I did for, for the first brow. 
um this brow is just my struggle brow it's really hard for me to just not even fill it in i'm not really i don't know what i'm trying to say but like you know how you have that one brow that never want to cooperate well this is my brow And you guys, it is okay if your brows don't look the same, like identical. Your brows will never look identical. And when I say never, never, because I have spent plenty of times, sometimes hours to try to make them identical and it never happens. So always remember your brows are always gonna be sisters, never twins. I'm sorry that um, I went out of frame for this part, but you guys get the gist. I know I look funky right now, but just wait till the end. It's, it's going to even out. Okay, for this part, I basically just took my fingers and just took the product and just bring it between my brows to just fill fill it out and blend it out in the middle and right here I'm basically using a mascara on my eyebrows this basically makes your brow hair stand out you don't have to do this part but it just makes it look a little bit natural well as natural as it can get right now I'm just basically checking out my work and right here I'm basically just taking more setting powder not even that much just to just mattify it some more because I am very oily and this is it you guys this is basically what I do to get these brows.